According to a consultant, the Jackson County Jail is in crisis because it can't retain enough officers to control a dangerous situation. Our Angie Ricono has done several stories about the problems at the jail, and here's just a few Facebook posts she received from people who've spent time behind bars there. David Kay writes, when I was in for a short time over a traffic warrant, there was feces all over the wall and toilet. It's completely gross. Nicole P writes, I was there 24 hours for traffic ticket in a holding cell and couldn't even use the toilet. It was overflowing onto the ground. Inmates were forced to go to the bathroom on the floor. George L says, the bologna sandwich I had waiting to be bonded on traffic ticket was green and hard. Felt bad for the guy who devoured it like he hadn't ate in a week. Nothing wrong with a little empathy and compassion, folks. I just heard on the news that the jailers down at the jailhouse been getting in all kinds of trouble, but they make a whole twelve dollars and fifty cents an hour. I think they said. You know, it's pretty amazing how the mayor can dictate and want to pass laws to force every business in Kansas City to pay ten or twelve dollars an hour for a minimum wage, but they can't pay guys that are working in the jail a decent living. This next viewer wants to continue the discussion about prisons and prisoners. Her idea is to use prisoners in our local jails to repair our crumbling streets. Why are we not letting our prisoners come out and do something about them? We're letting them sit in there. They get all the food they want for free. They get medical for free. We're giving them everything for free. Why not let them work for it? Okay, you've heard what those folks wanted to rant about. What about you? There's the phone number, 303-690-3000.